One by one. Come on, come on. 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 Come on, Blessings, my viewers. Welcome back to the channel. Watch, like, share, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Man accused of shooting an injured police officer in Central Village remanded. Three men who allegedly shot and injured a policeman in Central Village in Ketchin were remanded and their case transferred to the gun court. Kevin Morgan, 29, Denardo, James, 26, and a 30-year-old Andre Reed, all of Central Village address, are to return to the court on November the 10th. It is alleged that about 11 p.m. on October the 7th, a policeman went to, into Central Village on personal business when he was attacked by the accused, the accused men, who allegedly fired several shots hitting the policeman in the back. The victim was rescued and taken to the Spanish Town Hospital by his colleagues from the Central Village Police Station. An investigation was launched, which resulted in the trio being arrested and charged for the shooting incident. They are being represented by lawyer Laskell Clark, Shadi Bailey, and Stephen Jackson. St. Catherine Tapnakis Kanchak Nakis remanded. Alleged that the St. Catherine Kanchak Nakis Corey Renford was remanded when he appeared in this in the parish court today for the shooting death of an American woman, as well as the knockings of a Chinese businessman in his home. In the case of the woman, the woman in in the matter was transferred to the gun court and the case will be heard on november the 8th allegations are that about 2 30 pm on september the 23 shernet Haman was inside a taxi returning from a funeral in medaris at the memorial garden in sponge town when upon reaching a section of the road on red Pan main road the accused was fired on Eating several times, she died from the injuries she received. Renford 31 Alice Madwan, a painter from Fraser's content in Spanish Town, was later arrested and charged with Hammond's death. Meanwhile, in the death of the businessman, Renford was ordered to return to court on November the 29th. His lawyer, Kemai Mackenzie, the court.